Smart Deploy got itself a rebuild, but the real magic is all under the hood. Hi, I'm Jeff, Lead K-Grader Maintenance Engineer and Smart Deploy Support Team Manager. I'm here to share some details on the redesign that's Smart Deploy 3.0. When I say redesign, I mean some major architectural updates. This means that while we added a few things and set ourselves up to add loads more down the road, we're also going to be doing all the other stuff we've always done, but better. Smart Deploy V3 is designed with a cloud-first architecture. We switched to only using HTTPS for communication. This is going to make communication much more reliable and possible for almost all network environments without having to do the song and dance of verifying that a list of ports is open. We've also rewrote all of the client communication pieces to move from SOAP services to REST API. This is going to make a big difference for customers with a really large number of clients. Your console host server workload will be reduced and we're no longer utilizing the smart deploy client as a service. What else? Uh, there's loads more. We switched from SQL Express Local DB to MongoDB, and this is a more scalable database and makes troubleshooting and remediation of problems a lot easier on the support team so we can get you going faster if there is an issue. We've simplified file transfer. We are no longer using net.tcp to transfer files used in deployment. You might've found that this was even blocked at your site, depending on your security. Boom, next. Okay, there are two more things to mention. Uh, our applications like the platform and application managers have been retooled to use .NET Core. This is just to make it current and easier to plan for going into the future. So that's all the fun backend updates. I wanted to share without going too deep into the weeds about it. If you're interested to know more about any of these improvements, reach out to the support and we're happy to chat with you about it. Smart Deploy 3.0 is available now, so go give it a go.